New Zealand were dominant from the outset, sending Vanuatu's defence, which had been outstanding throughout their previous encounters, forcing goalkeeper Willie Dick into action early on. A decent attack from Vanuatu came through young New Zealand-based fullback Ronaldo Wilkins, almost sent Boncalo through own goal. New Zealand then opened the scoring with a wonderful set-piece finish, courtesy of Hunter Aswad. <laughs> 30 minutes in the action swung in New Zealand's favour as Maya Bevan struck the shot and this rebounded off the upright back into play for Moses Dyer to punch. The second half continued at the same pace as the first, but Vanuatu making clear attempts to pull themselves back into contention. The tide turned against Vanuatu in the 70th minute, when Frederick Massin lashed out at Bevan and earned his marching orders, leaving the side to play out the final 20 minutes of the game with just 10 men. New Zealand made the most of their player advantage, when in the 76th minute, Maya Bevan latched onto a great ball from Dyer to take his side three goal up. Two further goals were added to substitute Lucas Imri, who found the back of the net twice in quick succession. <laughs> Vanuatu technical advisor Declan Edge said it was a disappointing end to what had been a fantastic tournament of his side. Pleased with the performance in the first four games, uh, where we were very disciplined in those four games. We were. Uh, not too many yellow cards, we, uh, not too many free kicks away and we kept some good order uh, and for some reason today that sort of disappeared for a little bit and we were unstructured today, undisciplined and uh, we, as you saw we paid the price for that. On a performance like that in the final it was awesome, it was an awesome day for us, brilliant. Very proud, you know, uh, like I say they're a great set of lads, uh, we prepared really hard for this, you know, we prepared for every single game we played the same way and looked at the opposition, what the strengths and weaknesses are and how would we would deal with that uh, and then today it all came together really, probably our best performance of the tournament. In progressing for the final, both New Zealand and Vanuatu have qualified for the FIFA and the 20 World Cup Korea Republic 2017. Shane Saroya, National MTV Sports.